the one team that he that he will fit in with perfectly as far as the people around that area and all of that, he can't never go to again. That's Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? But the uh, one team, if he was anywhere else, that's what I would send him to. You know what I'm saying? Because ain't Orleans. nobody gonna be protesting down there. Actually, actually, the best chance he got is in his own backyard, the Redskins. They've already you know they it. trying to get rid of my boy no, Campbell. No, but you see the teams they've well, already put Campbell, out. Campbell didn't think that was anything. Wrong. You see the teams they already put out. They said Frisco. They said uh, Frisco ain't Seattle. Gonna, I don't beat him up no, I know, but there. you said. But I'm telling you what. I'm telling you what. Other GMs so dogs up said, there, they fucking Frisco, up. Seattle. They said Washington. <laughs> I didn't Here, say here's, it, it, hey, I didn't here's say the loop. Like here's the loop gonna throw you off. They said New England and they said Pittsburgh. Now, hey, they said New England and Pittsburgh. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Don't mention the that. The overseer. They, they, I, I'm not saying they can't put him with the overseer, who's also a Sith Lord. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they, they, I can see them putting him there because. Hey, see, you don't understand, man. You need to keep moving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, it's a Sith Lord. Man, tell him who the fuck is. The hoodie. The hoodie is a Sith Lord. Belichick. Man, I don't play that shit, man. Anyway, go ahead and make your point, though. Yeah, my point is that I could see him putting, putting, him, putting him there because, number one, Belichick is one of the few coaches that actually know how to take, hey, look, can you block, can you tackle, or are you fast? You know what I'm saying? Hey, use him accordingly. You know what I'm saying? And that means that the motherfucker's gonna be in with the quarterback. He ain't gonna be just the quarterback. I'm you telling know, you, you can forget that shit. You would have. They, no, they, they no, been, and, I, and I disagree. I I'm disagree. Gonna say, I'm they been, disagree. They've been destroying that quarterback. I disagree. For the last five to seven years. I disagree. The paradigm has changed. I'm gonna tell you why. This boy up in University of Washington, Jake Locker, and this boy down in Florida. The minute they step on the field, Tebow. Tebow. The minute they step on the field. And you say, you know what? I can do that with this. And he's blonde hair, he's brunette and blue eyed. I got it going on. There you go with the race car again. Okay. See, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, we're about to do a brain teaser right now, and we're gonna let you do it along with us. Man, what the I fuck? give you guys one minute to come up with three teams that he can start with right now. Minnesota. Oh, no, no, no. Not Boy, you so, okay? <laughs> the clock is ticking. And then we'll all go. Right, hey, hey, don't fall into this. This is all serious. He tried to. I'm not even trying to Chop Chop family, you with us? Watch this. The Raiders are excluded. Don't even say. You don't get your chance to say okay. your 13. Okay. We got 20 seconds left. All right. I don't need 20 seconds. Hey, man, this is bad TV, man. He's supposed to be doing no. shit. No, but they want to play with us, too. So let them get their chance to do it, too. All right, but this ain't live. Okay. <laughs> No, I, I, I really don't want Go you to ahead. fall into that trap. I'm not. I'm don't fall I'm into not that trap. Into oh, well, he got to play in that. No, he don't. No, That's what pissed me off about Keyshawn and all that. We didn't $72 million. That motherfucker's going to play. See, what, this is what bothers me the most. But he's fast, we know, no, strong, listen. We are so reluctant to speak <laughs> on anything. <laughs> <laughs> What's my man, Mike Peterson? You sound like a breeder. <laughs> Mike Peterson that went from Jacksonville to the Atlanta Falcons. Hey Mike, so what do you think about the whole situation? Oh, I don't want to speak. On, I don't want to speak on all. The master didn't give me a whole bunch. I don't want to speak on it. Motherfucker, they asked you a question. Who asked you a motherfucking question? So you're saying that he has? Hush now Uncle Tom asked hush money nigga. That's what the money is. Hush money. Hush money. He has enough money to hey, man. put inside of his mouth <laughs> and keep him from saying anything. We call this hush mouth money. You got motherfuckers like that, man. Don't want to hush mouth. All right, all right. Three teams. You you want to go first? Go first. Yeah, man. you know I'm okay. gonna light it up. Okay. The teams that I think that he can start for right now, I give you the first team, and I doubt if I get any uh, argument with anybody. I think Kansas City. He come in here, overweight, was... fat, shell uh, <laughs> tattoo. Put the bloodline. Hold on. <laughs> go. Blue <laughs> forty two. Okay, Kansas City. That's one team I really think that he can just go for his guns right now. Uh, even Tampa Bay. I was gonna say that. They got a yeah. nice rookie, and I think that you know Josh Freeman. Josh Freeman. That you wouldn't get any type of uh, argument for the next year and a half, two years, man. No, but the thing is, the offensive no, coordinator uh, that left Boston College, the one that got fired, he's in Tampa, and he's gonna run it with uh, Big Arnold. He's okay, but let me. I, 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 I say my third team. My, my third team, and this is a tough one. I really think San Fran as well. Okay, and that's my three teams. Go ahead, KP, your three teams. I got you. All right, three teams, Minnesota, number one, because I've already said it previous no shows. No explanation. Minnesota, it should be you. Make sure. Uh, number two, uh, Frisco. 
Frisco deserves it, needs it, and I guarantee you, you got a coach that will be stable for him. This is more or less something I'm putting out there. Uh, number three, uh, the team that I think that will work the best for him is, I want to say Kansas City, but I don't see it. And I'll probably say the Redskins because the Redskins are willing to take that that opportunity for him. So we're going to say Minnesota, and Minnesota, Minnesota Mr. Marcus, and, uh, All right. Washington Redskins. All right. I say New Orleans because, you know, the brothers is down there. Kansas City. And now, do we say you can't say the Raiders? Is that what we said? All right, and the Raiders. That's the three teams I would think. I like Drew Brees, though. I like Drew Brees too. I'm just saying, if, if, if he was the go-to man, man, I'm just saying. You I've been know, telling you about Drew Brees since he was at Purdue. Hold on, hold on. I'm here. just saying, Press Belusky does his job. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, but if Vic was to go down there and back up Drew Brees, and if Drew Brees gets hurt, who you start for? He can start there. I'm just saying he wouldn't start, but he could start. Okay, what three teams do you think he just come in there? And start? Just go in there and start. Kansas City, the Raiders, and I guess Tampa Bay. But I'd say New Orleans. Because I think New Orleans would be a good fit for him starting tonight. Yeah, Mr. Hitman. All right, I have to say he could start for the Raiders. And I'm going to tell you why. Even though we spent all the money in Jamarcus and everything. I was about the to fact say, is, his outfit. What? <laughs> hey, you the only one question. Don't let it throw you off, man. Don't let it throw you off. The reason why I say he come start for the Raiders, not because I want him to any of that, but because our offensive line isn't that strong. You're going to need a, a mobile, agile, hostile quarterback. You know what I'm saying? You know, so I definitely say Oakland. I definitely say Tampa Bay. Um, because, like you said, yep. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you where he could definitely go start, no matter what, no matter who. Kansas City, right? <laughs> Gay Diego. <laughs> yeah. Man, they make it too personal. Hey, hey, hey. They going to the Super Bowl. They make it too personal. We are. No, I'm going to tell you why. We are. You know what I'm saying? He's a producer for Happy Times. Hey, that's it. Because he's he's the only person as fast as the lightning bolts on their helmets. Hey, on the on the real man, I truly believe this man is gonna come in believe? and he's gonna he's gonna make everybody believe they were. And all of you, you, you hush money mouth believe niggas it. that don't hush want money, hush money mouth that don't want to support, <laughs> don't want to mess up your endorsements. Don't want to fuck shit up. Don't want to rock the boat. Fuck you. Because when you got motherfuckers like white boys like Slayer and all the motherfuckers backing him up. Well, when you got other white men from the other side of me, 